there, so he decides to escape out of there, and he doesn't pick up a first down, but he does gain additional yardage to set up a possible field goal attempt if they decide to go that route. Now here comes the Eagles offense as they get ready to take over. Leading them is their second-year quarterback, also the number two overall pick a season ago, Carson Wentz. Many wondered if they heard. Play action to Sproles. Wentz letting one go deep for the end. And this is caught. And how tough is it for the defense to account for a running back essentially being a receiver downfield? It's very difficult, especially if the running back has skills like a receiver, and you're aware of that before the game even begins. So throughout your practice sessions, you're going to want to be aware of him. Where is he lining up? What can he do? What kind of damage can he do to us downfield? And who can match up with him without weakening our overall defense? You're exactly right. Now it's the all-purpose back. This is Darren Sproles. And he is into the end zone. Touchdown, Philadelphia. Darren Sproles, a 12-yard touchdown run. And the Eagles had six to their lead. And that'll give them a two-score lead here, but I'm looking ahead. They just want to hold it for the final moments here of the second quarter. They don't want to give up. Any now a second down throw for Cousins. Able to shake him off. Throw it across his body, and it's intercepted. Able to get there and pick it. But he did have a teammate on the spot able to retain possession for them. be a place for methodically marching the ball downfield but when you can pick it up in big chunks and strike like that have explosive plays that's often the different receiver tight end but running backs they can be a big part of any passing offense nowadays and down inside the 15 shy of the 10 it's a 10-yard pickup but it moves the chains do my eyes deceive me or is he getting stronger as this game moves along Burst seems just as good here in the fourth as it was way back. Add six to their lead. Turning into a really good performance on the road. Week one, you're just hoping for that first win. It's tough to do it away from home, though, but they're looking strong. It certainly is. Any road... So that's the rookie's first trip to the end zone, and I think it's safe to say one he'll always remember. Oh, without a doubt. That one is going to be imprinted forever. And nowadays, we're seeing rookies make a greater impact at that position at receiver than ever before. I think mainly in their route running savvy. They'll drop to throw. Going to look deep for Jeffrey. That got a man. It's caught inside the 10. They'll run it now, out of the gun. He finds an opening past the 40. The 40, 30, 10, touchdown, Philadelphia. LeGarrette Blunt, his fourth touchdown on the year. And three defensively, pressure coming off that right side from the DM. And that's the blind side of most quarterbacks. If you're right-handed, that's the side you don't see quite as well. And that's why you rely on your left tackle. Maybe your highest-paid offensive line. 